you know, Sabi's made a, a, a pretty, pretty big investment here, uh, building out this lab and, and devoting uh, a dedicated space to uh, the forensics program. A lot of schools in this area are trying to do it. Um, you know, Sabe is actually making the big commitment to actually uh, investing some of its own money with a dedicated space, dedicated uh, desktops to our forensics and cyber students. Uh, Sabe also made uh, a pretty large investment with purchasing uh, Celebrite mobile forensics equipment, uh, hardware and software. Uh, this is uh, pretty cutting edge stuff uh, in the name of forensics. Uh, you know, there are a few vendors out there that are doing mobile forensics right now, but Celebrite uh, is one of the leaders. Uh, if you go back to the San Bernardino uh, terrorist case, uh, there was the big uh, drama about uh, one of the terrorist iPhones and, and cracking the iPhone. Uh, and Celebrite was the vendor that the FBI uh, chose to help them uh, crack the encryption on the iPhone and, and you know, able to collect and then analyze. Uh, some of the digital evidence on those phones. So, you know, Savi went ahead and made a, a really big investment. We've partnered with Celebrite. Uh, we've got the latest and greatest gear, the latest and greatest software, um, you know, and it's going to be an ongoing partnership. You know, this is just the beginning uh, of the forensics program here. This was my first semester teaching an undergrad class. Uh, and some of the feedback that I'm seeing from some of the undergrad students was, you know, I took a class in high school, uh, a digital forensics class in high school, which was unheard of a couple of years ago. They're coming to Salve saying, you know, for years, for the first couple of years that I was here, you know, I wanted to get involved with cyber, but I had to wait until the graduate program. Now, you know, Salve is starting to offer uh, some of forensics classes to our undergrad students. They're eating it up. You know, I, I think that th there's this is the first semester that I've been teaching. There's already a wait list uh, for these classes in the future. So, you know, with Sabe dedicating a space uh, and and hiring more faculty, uh, making investments in hardware and software, a space like this, equipment like this, is not going to just benefit uh, the cyber program, the ADJ program, but all of our students uh, as a whole. And I think you're starting to see it starting to creep into uh, some of the other verticals that that this university offers, and and, and eventually. You know, cyber is going to be a piece of every program that we have here and not just the ADJ program, not just the business program, but I think you're going to start, start seeing it spread uh, across all the programs.